previously on Sailing Britikin, preparing and provisioning a boat for passage. So what's the issue? Yeah, so we got a lot of meat in there. We're looking at this disturbance. People ask me about provisioning. Oh, you sneaky woman. We're smiling, but we should be crying. Bye. It's a mahi mahi. There's a lot of other fins circling it, so we might not have the fish by the time we bring it in. Okay, our first fish. It's a good way to pass the time. <laughs> What's for dinner tonight, son? We're having um, tuna tacos. And there we go. liters do we need to get to Bermuda? Hold that thought. We need 771 liters. 771 liters and how many do we have? 770. 770? <laughs> so that means we just need to sail a little bit between now and then. Yeah. So this is day two. Okay, two days into uh, sailing to Bermuda. Kim's in a normal position. I've had three throw-ups. Sienna's had three throw-ups, but she's watching Scooby-Doo with some broths. Torture chambers. I have not had three throw-ups, <laughs> but about to do the motion sickness medicine. Prevent any more throw-ups. <laughs> yeah. And we're sailing. I'm doing okay so far. Okay, Kim is sleeping in the main saloon. She, this is where she's been most of the time, either here or up in the um, cockpit. Bless her, she's not feeling very well. Um, we haven't been sailing for a year, and it seems as though the old sickness has come back. Before, after a while, she used to get used to it and didn't feel so bad, but now she does. So she's happily sleeping. While we are sailing, that's the waypoint five. We've got 327 miles, and then about another 100 miles after that. And Sienna is there. This is my view. I lay here on the sofa feeling pretty sick, and I look up at the boom, 
in the main, clattering. I hope I feel better soon. It's raining, but it's warm. What's for dinner tonight? Chicken pie. Look at this. I hope it tastes good. I've never made a pie before. <laughs> no pressure then. <sighs> so, oh, dear T, and T stands for Tooth Fairy. What is your name? I lost my tooth today. I'm sailing in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Please send me a note. You, me. And there's the tooth. How are the Fruit Loops? One. Yeah? Look at the rain coming down. That is just such a cool sight. There's rain coming down all there, right there. And then some more over here. Do you see it? There's a rainbow there. Yeah, what did the tooth fairy write to you? She wrote to me that um, what her name was and that um, where she was going. Yeah, she's going to Norway to help a child with bleeding gums. There's two? Yeah. Oh, Sienna just told me there's a double rainbow. Very hard to see, but there is a double rainbow. We're sailing. Um, we're, we're, he we're healed over quite a bit. Yeah, we're healed over quite a bit. We're uh, reefed at the moment with 30 knots of wind. 
we're doing eight knots and we're 175 miles away from Bermuda and we're going to be there in 22 hours. 20, 22 hours, that's good. I'm excited. Just looking at the grip files to determine if we have wind all the way or not. What's it looking like, Becky? Looks like we're gonna have some wind all the way, although it might turn to the east, which might not be as favorable, but we're gonna make it. <laughs> we're gonna make it. Okay, so here we are, we're playing Rummy Cup because we, we like playing this on the boat because the wind doesn't take away the cars. And Sienna's, do, Sienna's playing one of a second or third game of this on the boat while we're traveling. We have um, 24 hours to go and the wind's on our nose. And Kim is, all, is awake. I'm videoing you asleep. Oh no, lying down. But you did a great job because our clue decided to give up the ghost. I don't know if you can see that. I don't want to go out there because it's very windy. There, it's gone. So what we've done is we've gone to our first reef, we've put the engine on, we've taken most of the power out of the sail and we're motor sailing now. Joys of sailing. Well, as you can see, Kim's asleep again. bit rocky but we pre-made all the food so there was no making it up on here we just had to take it from the freezer and put it into there. I don't know if you can see. Look there. We got pasta bake. Bacon sarnies. Yeah. So you want educated bacon sandwiches with HP sauce. Yeah. Okay. We can see land. So. So we are almost to Bermuda. Yeah, just waiting for this cruise ship to clear the channel and then we can enter. So as we're coming into Bermuda, this amazing boat is coming out of Bermuda. And they're going to Newport, I believe. Is that stunning or what? That is amazing. So this guy here is 
just radioed us and he's gonna follow us in. Starting to see beautiful blue waters. So it's really narrow right here. Becky and Sienna are putting up the flag. Wow. This is so exciting. Okay. Yes, that's where you go, the dunker. You're always hungry. Next on Sailing Britican. We got lots of rest going on. I just wanted to say thanks so much for watching. We're approaching our 5,000th uh, subscriber to the channel, so if you like what you see, please help us get to 5,000. And uh, we also have reached our 20,000 nautical miles of sailing. If you're interested in supporting Britican and want to hear or read about our journeys. I've got a book that's published. It's on Amazon or on my online shop. You can get it hard copy or you can get it digital. We also sell t-shirts, jewelry, and digital guides about anchoring, buying a boat, all sorts of stuff. So if you like what you see and you want to support us, we could really benefit by the support to keep us going. Thanks so much for watching and uh, hopefully we'll meet you one day in a port.